thank you all for tuning in to interior designs with phantom energy my name is Amy fan and today i'll be walking you through my life if my occupational choice was an interior designer while unfolding the qualifications education responsibility and salary of an interior designer i'll be including videos of me interior interior designing my room after leaving buffalo state to begin while looking into the myers-briggs test i received careers like museum educator multimedia producer and fundraising director all things that i have experienced based off the results of the test. However, from the strong interest test, introduced me to careers that I may have not considered, such as entertainment manager or credit manager, urban regional planner, and interior design. Interior designers are considered workers of the service industry. Interior designers can be working from their office or from directly from their homes. The goal is to create a space that is aesthetically sound and functional and safe for whoever their clientele may be. The mission is to ultimately enhance the living or work of a space using things and elements of color, lighting, and decoration. An overall requirement of an interior designer is to tear it to the client and an ability to listen, communicate, and work in groups and teams effectively. The tasks of interior designers include plans, floor designs, furnishing interior, commercial or interior, commercial or industrial buildings. Elements also include in fabrication, installation, fixtures, accessories, paint, wall decor, and so on. Things have to do with elements of creating the space. However, all of this is contingent on creating and again, enhancing the living or work of said client. The concentrated the concentrated career I've chosen in interior design is interior decorator. In this line of work, I'll be coordinating with other professionals in interior designing, such as architects, engineers, plumbers, home light advisors, kitchen designers, sustainable designers, and just universal designers in all. In collaboration with all of these designers in interior design, I'll ultimately create and generate material requirements, costs, and present a full design describing all the things my clientele will need for their project. To be an interior designer, there isn't really much qualifications. Majority of what of the jobs that I've found said a bachelor degree in interior design. In some states, a license is required. The median annual salary was 49000 at most and you must have certificate or an understanding of computer aid designs a lot of the two jobs that i found were acu cabinets and their qualifications included well they were interior design for two years and sales with looking in artistic and detail orientation candidates with interpersonal skills for the position of interior design the second job i found was from transform transform focus and in or in an area of which in design where storaging was a main thing for people and a service that in pitch people needed it is a skill in which someone can try and create as much space in which the space they have given that means to sell and custom wall units beds homes office closets and for home order need for home owner needs their qualification included a design degree one year work experience knowing how to use cad which is again computer aid design, reading and interpreting architectural designs, interpret interpersonal skills, and highly motivated. Overall, for my six occupations, interior designs, credit manager, entertainment manager, urban regional planner, museum educator, and restaurant manager that I've chosen, I have fully settled on interior design. And from these qualifications and descriptions, I will show you through my room how I was able to achieve this in the thought and light of my Myers-Briggs test and strong interest test. Interior design relates to my interest because I enjoy colors, aesthetics, and details that creatively make my career fun. My ability to problem solve to a certain degree allows me to strengthen, to flex, storage, and confine a space. I value environment at a workspace and working in teams to produce quality content. Overall, I enjoy the career as possibly being an interior designer. Although creating my space when I came back from college was a little bit difficult, it was actually fun to know that I possibly could take this as a possible career. Thank you for tuning in to Interior Design with Phantom Energy.